Oh, good morning, loves. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, guys. Listen, so I'm on my way to work this morning, and it is so cold out here. I think when I left the house, they said it was 22 degrees or something like that. It is so cold out here, loves. You have to layer up, bundle up. I got the big coat on. Oh, see, I got the big coat on. Um, but it's freezing. It is so, so cold out here. Girl, I do not feel like doing this. I really, really do not feel like doing this. Like, guys, let me let me share a secret with you guys. Um I don't know if I probably want to hear this first thing in the morning, but I don't know. I just wanted to get on here and talk because it's been something that's been bothering me. Maybe you guys can help me out. Um, I have talked to my husband about it. I have even talked to my children about it. My older children, that is. And I am so contemplating with quitting my job. I am. I'm, I'm really thinking about quitting my job. Now, I don't want to quit my job, but I think it came to a time where I have to quit my job. And the reason being, I don't know if I, all y'all know, I'm a CNA, a certified nursing assistant. <clears throat> it has became too much for my body, the work. There's a lot of wear and tear, pulling and tugging, and, and stuff like that. It has became a lot on my body and I'm thinking about quitting um I'm too young to quit work and collect some social security or something like that I'm too young for that and your girl don't want to go work in a Walmart or nothing like that so I don't know I don't know I'm trying to figure this thing out I'm really trying to figure this out trying to figure it out guys I don't know so I say that to say that every day I get up and get ready for work it's a struggle it's really a struggle because I know what I'm about to go in here and do and I know how I'm gonna feel at the end of the day I mean and don't get me wrong not every day I come out feeling bad not every day some days I'm fine some days going to work is the best thing for me because you know get get my energy up and get me to move in but then some days I just can't do it. I just can't do it. So, and you know, when you work in a full-time job, it's not it's not one of those things where, okay, you can't do it today, we'll see you tomorrow. No, they expect you to be to work. They expect you to be to work. So look, guys, enough of me ramming about my body, about... Hi, I'm feeling getting to work. Don't, don't, you know, don't worry about that. You guys go. I just wanted to tell y'all to have a beautiful day, a wonderful day. Have a blessed day. Don't let no one steal your joy because no one gave you that joy. That joy is given by the Lord himself. So no one can steal your joy. Okay, loves? So I will see y'all in a little bit. Let me get on here to this place, y'all, to the slave ship. i see y'all in a little while. Hi everybody, so I'm off of work. Yes, I'm off of work, y'all. I made them donuts. It's over, it's quitting time. I'm done, I'm on my way home. Only if I wish. So, I have my daughter in the passenger seat. She met me at my job. We're on our way to find her some stuff because she's moving and I want to go get her some things to help her get started. So we're on our way to. I got some. We're going to stop at Ross. This um, shopping center up here got a Ross. They got a TJ Maxx. Can you please put your seatbelt on, young Thank lady? <laughs> Thank you. They got a Ross. They got a um, TJ Maxx. Um, they have a Dollar General. Family Dollar. Uh, 
I think that's about it. So we're gonna go and see. We're gonna go and see what we can get out of here. See what we can find for her new place. I'm gonna go on Ross. So maybe I can find her some nice little towels and washcloths and you know, little stuff like that. Maybe um some pots or some silverware or you know nice little trash can little stuff like that so guys i'm on my way to ross i am exhausted but i gotta make this happen so we're on our way if ross don't have the music going i'll turn it, the camera when i get in ross all right loves <laughs> I just left Ross. Listen, so it's so crazy because when me and my daughter walked in there, we like, oh, they ain't got nothing in here. Ain't nothing in here. They ain't got nothing. Girl, we started pulling stuff back, moving stuff out the way. We was finding some treasures in there. I don't know if people were trying to hide it for themselves or what was going on, but we found the girl. We found it. Let me tell you. Woo, now your girl on her way home. I am tired dusty busted everything i need to go home get in the shower the girl is tired looking bad i'm looking bad out here in these squeaks looking real bad girl i gotta get home i'm so exhausted but she got some really really nice stuff her little place gonna be just so cute just so cute her little place is gonna be so cute so we got like all the little accessories to go with her furniture her furniture ain't come yet um we still working on the furniture we know what we want but we just have to get like a date that they're going to deliver it and stuff like that but so we just went and got all the little stuff that's going to go around the furniture to make it just come all together pull it all together so cute so cute so cute Woo, but your girl is tired, y'all. Woo, my shoulders hurt, my back hurting. Yes, honey. Everything. I feel like I've been working. See, this is this is what bring me joy. I like doing this. I like shopping. I like putting it together. Girl, I don't like going to work. I, I I had the wrong profession, girl. When I die and come back to life, I'm gonna be a um. An interior designer, decorator, interior decorator. That's what I'm gonna be. That's what your girl gonna be. Cause I got, I got it. I got it, girl. I got it. All right, love. So let me get in this house. I'm gonna end this video. Thank you guys. I wish I could have showed y'all more in Ross, but um, music was playing and it looked as so dry and empty in there. Y'all didn't want to see that. So empty. I mean, I can actually show y'all what we got when we get home. But that going to mean taking everything out the car and then reload everything back in the car. So what I do, I'm going to end this video here. But I promise you guys, I'm going to show y'all everything we got when we get to her place. Okay? So we'll be going to her place soon. So when we get to her place, I'm going to show you everything we got from Ross. Tell you how much it was and all that good, good stuff. All right, love. So I talk to y'all on another one. Bye.